gadgets and tools that are going to make you look like a superstar it, yes. in the kitchen. Hey, you know what's so funny? And I, and I was talking with, with Kat, and, and yep. Kat's over there, man. Oh, everybody's here. And, and you know, I'm lucky because I, I grew up in kitchens and I know how to do stuff, right? right, right. I worked in a restaurant business for 15, 20 years, whatever the heck it was. So I know how to cut an avocado, and, 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 but a lot of people don't. Right. And so we have come up with a tool. This is the best part. Look at it. It takes the, takes the seed out. Look at that. Pop. Twist and pop. <laughs> All right. And, and then... Look at this. It's got the scooper it's on got the other the scooper side. scooper on the other side so you can scoop the whole dang thing out. Are you kidding me? There it is. So this is our, our progressive guacamole avocado tool set. It's only $19.95. So you can scrape everything out, scoop it all out. You have a, a blade on one side, which cuts the avocado. Can also score the avocado if you want to do that. A lot of you like uh, chunks in your, right. uh, in your guacamole. And uh, it's just the right sharpness so it's not to be dangerous. Right. It has a very, very, very subtle serration to it. But look at how that works. And then you can scoop it depending on how ripe or unripe they are. Makes that job easier. 1995. And this is also a, uh, a must have for anybody that likes to do a kitchen and wants to, you know, wants to have the uh, ability to do things on their own without having to ask somebody to help them all the time, you know? Right. But I love it, John. And by the way, uh, this is uh, final quantities on this. We don't have a lot. My producer, Jared, will let me know when this sells out. But if you love an avocado, you got to have this. Listen, if you like guacamole, avocados, maybe it's avocado toast, there's so much that you can do with avocado. Avocados, and it's really, I mean, avocados have become probably one of the most popular fruits out there today. Yeah. And the reason, well, they're, they're so healthy and good for you. Is okay? it a fruit? Is it that is what actually, it is? It's a fruit. It grows on a tree, hey. right? Yeah, <laughs> that's true. You're and right. look at this. All you do, you use this knife. Now, the knife folds away so it's easy to store. You can do just, just about anything with an avocado. I mean, look at this. With that scoop, it's got this... Uh, it, it's got this silicone scoop. Now I want, want to show you this. This is very flexible, okay? So it fits inside, gets completely cleans out the hole, and all three parts to this, okay, are dishwasher safe. And literally, all you do is fold it up like this, pop that in the dishwasher, it's done. It's easy to clean, easy to use, and that quick and easy. I mean, we just did two complete a whole avocados, and I want you to see this because this here's is, the best this part. Is why, you notice yeah, this bowl. This is why I would buy this. <laughs> right? It's not so much for the tool, but for the, the bowl the that comes with it. The tool is cool, but yeah. if you want to make your, uh, let's let's say, for example, here, we're going to do a quick guacamole, all right? Okay. I'm going to add some extra ingredients, some tomatoes to in there. We're going to yeah. put some chopped onion in here. Uh, we're going to do a little bit of, and you can use Use uh, uh, garlic if you like, a little cilantro, and of course, lemon juice over the top. Now here's the secret to making a good guacamole. All right, the secret is a little heavy handed on the salt, all right? Now, I always like a little pinch of pepper in mine too. That's fine. And you can add whatever ingredients you want to yeah. this. Now you can mash it up. If you've got one of these mashers, it fits perfectly inside of this bowl. Or you can use a fork if you like. But you make your avocado guacamole, just like I'm showing you here. Yeah, yeah. Or any way that you like to do it at home. Again, add the ingredients that you like. It's done literally in seconds. Okay. But here's the best part about this, okay? You see this lid? There's a silicone rim around this lid and it fits perfectly on the inside of this bowl. And watch what happens because as I press this down, you'll notice how what? it takes every bit of air oh out of gosh. that container. And I gotta tell you, for storing your guacamole, because let's face it, you make up a ton, you never seem to eat it all, and then you pop it in the fridge in your normal container like this, and this is what it ends up like yeah. about three or you four hours later, like? right? Caca. Yeah, that's right. what that looks like. Guy, I gotta right? show you this. Eddie? This Nobody one, wants to eat that. <laughs> you see this right here? This <laughs> was put in the fridge three days ago. Okay, because there's no air inside there, it'll never turn. I'd spend $20 and just for that. Now, to get this out Honestly. of here, okay, yeah. Progressive put, it has, has put these little finger tabs Watch. on either side. So all you do is lift, oh my you gosh. scrape, and there's your guacamole right. ready to eat fresh. All without right. turning brown. Cat, you it's were a right. saver, a keeper, it's really and I'll tell cool. you what, it's worth I it just for this. I try to put plastic wrap <laughs> and stuff like that on it, and it doesn't matter what you do. If you, if, if even a little bit of the air gets in there, right. it's going to oxidize That's and it's right. going to turn it bad, just like it does the same with an apple. There yep. are certain fruits and vegetables that oxidize when the air hits them, they turn a funky color. And I'm also convinced that that oxid, that ox, whatever it is. Oxidation. The oxidization. Yes. Is it oxidation? Oxidation. 
It doesn't taste good. No, it's kind of. It does. It changes it has kind the, of flavor a dead of the flavor. Flavor. It looks like dead food. That's right. Um, now this, and, and remember, this will stay that bright color day after day after day because yes. you are eliminating the enemy of that particular uh, fruit, which is air. Air I, is the enemy brilliant. of all food, and especially yeah. with avocados. If you've ever split an avocado and put the other half in the fridge, <laughs> you know it never lasts, right? Now all you do. By the way, this pit remover. Yeah. You'll notice, okay, I'm gonna give you a little tip. You'll see there's, there's little traction things on the on the one yeah. side. It's not really sharp, but it digs into that pit so you can twist it, pop it out, ah. and then you take it right to your trash can. And look at this, you just give it a tap and it goes right into your trash can. Nice. Now, you can take that scoop or, here, I'm gonna split this up. Now this knife is sharp on one side, dull on the other, okay? And it folds back into the handle. So uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna slice all right, it's this avocado. And then I'm gonna use the scoop, and I'm gonna scoop these slices out, and perfect, watch this. This is a great idea for um, breakfast. We're gonna do your avocado, egg, av avocado toast with egg, all right? And look at this, I mean, it comes out beautiful, Perfect. Hard to hold out of those and things. I, though, I know they are kind of slippery, <laughs> <laughs> but delicious, oh healthy, and good yeah. for you. And I'll tell you what. Yeah. Here's the best part about this: when you pop that yolk and it goes everywhere, that's the breakfast of champions yeah. right there. That's yours, John. By the that, way, that's it was the my one finger you're in the yolk. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you got to hey, break the yolk. <laughs> let me let me tell you something. And I'm so glad uh, that you guys that, that our kitchen crew put this together because, you know, they when you think they think of avocados and they always think, oh, that's one of those ones that's full of fat. I don't want to eat. That. You have to understand that is the good fat. That's right. The very good fat. That's the fat that helps you with digestion. That's the fat that, that helps you in the long run. So do not think about the oil that's in avocado per se. It's just like when you eat nuts. It, again, it's just don't eat 35 avocados a day. Right. But you can certainly have an avocado a day. Have a half avocado like that in the morning yep. with an egg. That's Look at all the protein there. And then we put some uh, that toast, I'm sure, has got some more fiber in it than most trees. So, so that's going to be good for you. So you can eat healthy if you take advantage of what's out there. And you know, we're here in Florida, so we get these beautiful avocados. California, <laughs> uh, we get them, we get both Florida and we get the Haas, That's right. uh, which are the California avocados, and they're both delicious. Uh, and this will work on both, by the way, on the Florida avocado too, right? Because yep. that's kind of big. Yes, absolutely. In the middle of it. Use it yeah, you can use it on any avocado. All right, so that was a quick but special. Again. We'll let you know when it sells out. The bowl is why you buy I'll that. I'll tell you. The yeah, bowl is why you bowl. buy Hey, coming up in just a bit, and I have my pr producer, uh, Jared, convinced and he is going to buy one today. You know why Jared wouldn't buy it in the past? Because he's cheap and it was expensive. Remember it all right, Jared? Jared was like, I'm not spending $200 on an air fryer. I just can't guess what we've done. And this is the original air fryer. Jared's not cheap, I'm just messing with him. Although he should get a new pillow. That old pillow is, that's just nasty. Uh, anyway, um, I, I digress. So, so let me tell you why you want you need this machine, okay? Because first of all, if you're looking to cut fat and calories, but you don't want to give up on that crispy fried food you love, you need to get an air fryer. This is the original. This is the one that was $199.95. Times being what they are and prices coming down, they dropped the price for our best value of the day by $100. Uh, gray uh, is exclusive here, red as well, comes in white comes in black. It's the perfect size. You want to do French fries. You want to do onion rings. You want to do the best grilled cheese you've had in your life. You want to do fajitas. You can do it all. Why heat up your giant oven, which starves your house of the energy and costs you a fortune when you can heat up this small insulated oven? It's uh, it's amazing. Rapid air technology. We'll get into all that in a bit, but if you want to pre-select it, go ahead. Gray is the most limited. Let's talk about uh, getting your food prepped before you put it in the air fryer. And what you're going to want to do is maybe you're going to want to make French fries. Maybe you're going to want to do dehydrate some veggies. Maybe you're gonna wanna make salads. Well, the Nutri-Slicer is the go-to machine. It is unbelievable. It is whisper quiet, because as you notice, there is nothing to plug in. That's right. We can bring it anywhere and everywhere we want. It's easy to operate. Uh, the perfect kitchen companion, it comes with four interchangeable stainless drum attachments so that you can do a variety of cutting jobs. What I love about it, Mr. John, there yes. is that it's super fast. It's consistent, <laughs> yes. always the same slice That's because right. it's a machine, but the fact that um, it's convenient. I can take this out. I read 
rinse it out when I'm done. It's easy to operate. That's right. It's got the little uh, it's got four suction different drums on the, on the yep. thing. It's the stays. base suction's down to your oh countertop. My gosh. You pick the blade that you like, you snap it inside, and all you do is take your fruit, vegetable, whatever it is that you want to slice, place it in the top, and you can do this right into a salad bowl, into a frying That's pan, into a soup pot. But look at this, perfect uniform slices, and your fingers never get close to the cutting blade because it's got that little plunger. Now, what I like about it, Guy, the most, I mean, you mentioned that, you know, all the, some of the features. I love it because your fingers never get close to those cutting blades. Right. But look, 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 at the size, look at the size of the bowl of That uh, is unbelievable. That and by the did. way, the blades, uh, and John will remind you this, yes. never need sharpening nope. because? Because they never hit a countertop or cutting board like a knife. Love now, that. Watch this, because for pan fries, home fries, raw fries, American fries, cottage fries, scallop potatoes, homemade potato chips, all you do is what? put a place your potato inside, and look at this, you got homemade potato chips, literally done in seconds, or scallop potatoes. You can put an onion in here, half an onion in here, slice your onions. It, it saves you so much time. And guy, you and I talk about this all the time. Cooking doesn't take time. It's the preparation of the food that takes That's the time in the kitchen. All the downtime, yep. I gotta show you this because the three or four inserts, I guess, because normally it comes with three. Today here, at HSN, we have an exclusive blade, okay. okay? You get your grating blade, this is the coarse grater. You get your fine drum, your fine grating drum. You get your slicing drum that I was just showing you with the potatoes and all the other uh, veggies. And you get this, I call it the ripple or wavy drum. Wavy yeah. fries. Watch this. Love yeah. those. Place this one inside and watch the difference. You can take, uh, you can take a zucchini or a, or a, a, a uh, look at this. All you do is place, oh. place it through the top. Every turn of that handle guy, it gives you four, uh, four slices, like with a knife. Ruffles have so, ridges. Yeah, yeah, look at this. All I you do you. is give it a turn, you get perfect <laughs> slices. And you can do this with your radishes oh, for salads. Awesome. Place two or three radishes inside that. that cup. And all you do is turn the handle, and I mean, it's done literally wow. in seconds. It's like a hurricane coming out of the front of this that machine. Is awesome. it, and look, you get those perfect ripple or wavy slices. So if you wanted to do ripple potato chips, well, now you just place a potato on the top and you're making those ripple potato chips, okay? So if you've got the air fryer, uh, you know, if you've got an air fryer, yeah. you place these inside, I'll tell you what, you oh get the most gosh, delicious right? ripple potato chips you'll yeah. ever have in your life. And it's done literally in seconds because they're paper thin. And look at that, remember, soak them in a little bit of water, yeah. dry them out, pat it dry, oh. put them in right inside, and you can make the most amazing, wonderful, uh, and healthier oh, uh, yeah. meals for yourself, yeah, too. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And here's, here's the thing, I'm gonna give you a quick tour of the machine because whether you get it in red, white, or black, Black, it doesn't matter, they're all the right. same. On the base, you'll see this little lever, okay? When you place this on your countertop, all you do is turn the lever, it locks it, suction-wise, it suctions it right down to your countertop or tabletop. This is your pusher, okay? There's a button on the back of the handle. When you push this button in, it releases the handle from the drum, okay? So when you place this drum inside the machine and then yeah. clip that handle on, that's, that's what turns inside the machine. It's so simple, so now to clean it, there's a little tab right down here in the front. You pu push down on that tab, and the whole top of the machine comes off. Oh this gosh. is dishwasher safe, and this is the only thing that really touches any veggies or fruits and, uh, other than the drum. And the barrel, so yeah. to clean that out, you can rinse it like a knife or dishwasher safe, Locks snap in. it back in place. I'm gonna switch over, guy. Actually, you know what? Here, I'll show you the coarse grating drum first, because with this one, I gotta tell you. You saw me slice those potatoes. If you like hash brown potatoes, You'll grate oh carrots for carrot cake, potato for potato pancakes, hash browns. You'll grate sharp cheddar cheese, Parmesan cheese. You'll grate carrots. You'll grate coconut. You'll grate chocolate. And it does it all safe, fast, and easy. Your fingers never get close to those blades. There's two entire potatoes, perfect for hash browns, scattered, covered, smothered, Man, whatever dude. you like, right? Man. And, I Look mean, there's that. a whole bowl full of hash browns. Can now, you, here's the thing. you doing that with a box grater. Oh, you, you mean one of these old <laughs> knuckle boxes? You're right. You're yeah. trying to do that. There's nothing to protect your fingers. I mean, when you get close to your fingers with this, you have to stop, yeah. otherwise you take off a nail or a knuckle. Oh! <laughs> now with this about. machine, look at this, and it's easy to clean. The, the drums pop out, again, all stainless steel, dishwasher safe, yeah. but watch this. I'm gonna switch over, and I'm gonna show you uh, the fine blade, because if you do any baking, you're gonna love this for making homemade breadcrumbs, especially, uh, well, I used to watch my grandmother do this, 
uh, she'd take a rolling pin and a bag, you know, those zip, zip bags. Yeah, smash and, it. And then she'd, she'd put the crackers inside the zip bag, and then she'd roll the rolling pin on the bag until the bag broke, and the cracker crumbs went all over the kitchen floor, and then oh you, you'd hear my grandfather in there. You know, anyway, I mean, it comes out perfect. So you can do saltine crackers like I that. just did. How about Man, this? Here's breading. an idea. Oh, my gosh, right? Yeah, for, for doing breading fish chicken, and stuff fish, like that. or meatloaf. Oh, my gosh. How about for cake? Uh, look at this. You can do graham crackers for graham cracker crust. You can do, oh, here, get creative. Let's, let's, throw, well, some, like uh, let's croutons. throw some croutons in there. You can do dry bread. Yeah. You can do stale bread. You can do, you know, toast. All you do is put it in here, give it a turn, and there's your Italian seasoned bread crumbs, oh not gosh. sitting in a can on a shelf that you buy yeah. in the store, fresh, okay? Here, here's some ideas too. Oh, oh by the way, I'm gonna take a handful of cheese, cheeses, okay? Place these in top. Uh -oh. Get creative. Hey, listen, do this on your for your chicken. As a chicken breading, cheese, how good, cheddar cheese, how good chicken would breading. Chicken I mean, with that on a oh, coating, big. Can you imagine? Cheese it, and chicken. <laughs> Are you and kidding I'll tell you, me? I know. Think about the, the just oh think of the, all the options that you get with this. But I would buy it just to make cheese at chicken. I got to tell you, if a grater that, doesn't grate you know cheese. That, you ever have the, the, the cheddar grooves? They're called grooves. Yeah. They're the best. Those are so, I'm addicted to those. <laughs> you make a crust out of that? Because they right. always have like a cheddary Swiss flavor to them. Oh, they're so good. You can do it as well. Yeah. Hey, hey, Jared, really quick. Can we put up the uh, credit card? Because can you get this for $9.95 if you get a new credit card? If you buy, if you get an HN credit card today, get approved, this is $9.95. You know, and you don't have to go and spend $100 on no, a food processor. I know, and that's right? the thing. And there's no batteries, you don't have to plug it into the wall. All you do is crank the handle. You can place this right on your kitchen table, right in the middle of the table. On taco night, the kids can grate their own yeah. cheese for taco night. On Italian food night, look at this, maybe it's a pasta dish that you're making. Now you can do your Parmesan cheese, fresh, right off the block, right at the kitchen table. And the kids can do it themselves, too. And look at this, I mean, you get Look at this. Light, fluffy oh Parmesan gosh, cheese that'll beautiful. melt right into your mouth. Now, to clean it again, you just pop the blade out. And by the way, here, I'm going to show you this, too, because you'll have so much fun with this machine. I'm going to throw that Parmesan down here and switch out this blade again. I'm going to put the coarse grating blade in this time. And you know what? Here, I'm going to do something real quick. I'm going to clean this out. Yeah. It, well, yeah, if you're doing a lot of stuff like we're doing, give it a tap <laughs> once in a while because it's, <laughs> we're, we're, it's we're working very overtime simple. here. All you do is snap the handle on, give it a turn, and watch this now. Because if you like egg salad, Aww. maybe tuna fish, chicken salad, or I just regular, look at this. All you do is turn. I can put my pickles <laughs> you can, in there too. You can put I? pickles in here. You can add whatever ingredients you like. Do two or three eggs at a time if you like. But look at this. And Instead of mashing up your eggs with a fork or trying to cut them Man. with a knife or putting them in a food processor like nobody would ever do, but you can add whatever no, seasonings you that, like. Guys. And look at this. Look you got this. mounds of hard boiled eggs grated perfectly. You know, for if, egg you, salad, if you like, like tuna cob fish. salad and stuff like that, I'll guarantee, I bet you could put some turkey in there and you could put some chicken in there if you yeah, wanted and to. If you hey, put the slicing blade in, yeah. now you can slice your eggs for a salad. But here, yeah, I watch, do the whole watch thing this. In there. Here, I got to show you this guy because this is what gets me excited about this machine. Yeah. It's it's so great. It will grate literally everything in the kitchen. Okay. From soup I'm gonna to put I'm gonna put some peanuts in here. Nuts. Those could be uh, almonds, walnuts, cashews. I'm gonna throw some M and M's in here. Okay. Yeah. Because I noticed right out here in it's the like front. Like a potpourri. And I'm gonna I, I'll tell Various you what. I've got an ice cream bowl toppings. here. Watch this. Yeah, you can put it whatever you like. Can Turn that up? handle. Can I put and my you've head got under grated there? peanuts. You've got M and M's. You can do any hard candies that you like for an ice cream topping for cake for oh, pies. Yeah. Here, take a chunk of chocolate and put it in here. And watch this, because you know, just for chocolate, all you do is give, <laughs> give it a turn. Dude, you and know how good you've that got is? your grated chocolate for your, for, for your uh, cake oh toppings. Oh my God. For, uh, maybe it's that latte. Maybe, uh, here, don't I think I've got a spoon somewhere That's here. That's ridiculous. I don't if need you a do spoon. any baking at all, you're gonna love this for just toppings. I mean, Anyway, now you can make them fresh instead of buying them made up for you in the grocery store. That is. I mean, just for that alone. God, you could sell I that in little bags at flea markets. <laughs> yeah, you probably could. You take M&M's. Hey, just take yeah. peanut M&M's. Cut out the middle, man. Don't put peanuts in M&M's. Get peanut M&M's and chop those guys up. <laughs> that a is little really whipped good. cream on top of that now, and you're ready to go. Oh but God. like I said, you're going to have so much fun with this machine. Try chocolate? this, too. How about an ice cream topping? Like, try this, okay? Take some of those pretzel rods. Yeah. If you like 
like ice cream? Look at this. Take pretzel rods. You can you can grate down those pretzel rods, turn yeah. them into pretzel, basically dust, if you like. Can this you is with the coarse white grate. Chocolate okay. Pretzel you rods. want some white chocolate in here? <laughs> All you do is give that handle a turn. There we go again. <laughs> Hold on. Let's try it, this it's one. It's like a hurricane of chocolate wait, wait, wait. coming out there of there. There we go. And like, <laughs> I mean, and look, now you can put that topping That's over your ice cream. That's better than the cream. last topping. I, I'm telling you, you oh have so much gosh. fun with this machine, and the kids Pretzel can do it too. Pretzel white chocolate yeah. dust. The kids can do it too. So you have some fun with the machine. Again, if all you use it for is cheese, it's worth it. But this wow. machine literally does everything but the cooking. I'm going to take this blade out. Watch this. I'm going to go back to that ripple blade because that ripple blade, this is exclusive to HSN. This is the only place in the country that you can get this blade. Everywhere else, you can get the, uh, the, you know, the three other blades with the machine, but this ripple blade is exclusive here. It comes with the machine, and look at the job this does. I mean, for your ripple slices, all you do is place the vegetable on top, give the handle a turn, <laughs> the job's done that I, quick I and am, easy. It's so impressive, by the way. And by the way, <laughs> if you want to dehydrate things like this, oh yeah, or if you want to bake them, we have our today's special coming up uh, in just a bit, our Phillips air fryer, so you can actually crisp these things up in your air fryer as well right I, you know and you're right i, I mean i we spent I, i'd have my kitchen what guys spending do? three hours down in our basement prep area and all they were doing was cutting veggies they would cut veggies they would cut chicken they were doing all this prep work that's the hassle when you have this and notice too we can have a conversation while you're doing yeah, it. Yeah, it's not it's like a not, blender. No, it's not noisy. <laughs> it's not like a vacuum cleaner or a blender no, or something like that. No, you know, like this that. reminds me almost like the, the my mom had an old school, it would lock on the counter, yep. meat grinder. Yep. That's kind of what it's like. That's kind of what easy, it's like, right? exactly. All you do is lock it to your countertop, place whatever fruit or vegetable that you like in this, or you can make your breadcrumbs and do your ice cream toppings. You can do all of that fun stuff. But I'll tell you what, just for, listen, you will grate, just for the grating, You'll grate carrots for carrot cake, potatoes for potato pancakes or hash browns. You'll yeah. grate sharp cheddar cheese, Parmesan cheese, grate carrots, coconut, chocolate. It grates everything but you. Safe, fast, and easy. Because it has that little pusher on top, your fingers never get close to the blades. You don't waste anything. Everything goes right through the machine. But look at that for zucchini bread or zucchini you muffins. Or if you're into thinking. zucchini pastas, yeah. it's fantastic. You, and the reason you yeah. don't do that is because of this. Because it's hard to do. Yeah. Now you can do Listen, it easily. If you're Carrot used to grating on one of these, oh, John, you got to get that. the slicer. I mean, it does everything but the cooking. And like we said, not, you know, cooking doesn't take time. It's the prep that takes yeah. the time in the kitchen how long would it take you to do that with one of those old box graders I, and, right? and you know what and, it would, and i'd be t taking my life in my hands there i'm getting ready to take off your knuckle and yeah. you don't want to deal with that <laughs> remember when you order this today all you need to, to ask for is what color we have i have it in red i have it in white and i have it in black when you order don't forget you're going to get your uh, you don't get a choice you get all these blades uh you get the uh, original slicing blade the uh, waffle blade yes you get the the fine grater and the regular grater and these are what they make you can, actually that's a better shot you can see what they do but on top, this is this is kind of what what the veggies look like. So there's your regular chips, your uh, waffle chips yep. or ruffle chips. There's your fine fine grated shred. zucchini, and then look at that. Carrots. So like we said, if you're a baker, if you like to make cakes, if you like to enjoy your cooking, but you don't like cutting veggies, and a lot of people, John, let's face it, a lot of people suck with a knife. Yeah, not good with it. Just face it. I mean, but this with this machine, it. it makes it quick and easy. All right, save me a bowl or whatever it is we ground <laughs> up there. I'm gonna eat that later. We're gonna the come back. Cream. Best value of the day is coming. Stick around. <laughs> Have you signed up for your HSN email? Sign up for HSN emails now to stay connected to our hottest deals of the week. You'll even receive exclusive coupons. Never miss a today's special. We'll send you the scoop on our best value of the day straight to your inbox. Head on over to hsn.com now and search email to sign up today. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. 
Jewelry House Pick is here, and this is one you don't want to miss. We've worked with our designers to create one-of-a-kind collections. You'll find new and unique pieces, the standouts and the statement makers. We'll share our favorite brands, exclusive designs, and tips on how to wear them. Every piece hand-selected by us for your unique style. We've picked our favorites. Now it's time for you to discover yours. Jewelry House Pick, tonight at midnight, and shop the whole collection now at hsn.com. The Cheryl Crow Collection. It's everything that I love. It's very vintage inspired. Great jeans, incredible boots. It has a rock and roll twist. One of the things I love about it is that I'm able to empower women with some of my lyrics inside the clothing. Statements that are in my music that still, when I sing them, empower me. The Cheryl Crow woman is the woman that takes on life and says, I can do anything that I want to do and still be feminine. All right, I know y'all love fried food. Everybody does. It's it's the, one of the things we crave like crazy, right? Problem is all the fat, right? Well, if we told you we had a way to be able to cut out of the fat and still get the great results you'd listen, well, guess what? We have the original Phillips air fryer at half price. We're so proud of it. We made it our best value of the day. Here it comes, today's special. Pop it in, you take it out, and you put it down on the tray. Notice what's missing. Drippy, drippy fat and grease, yet crispy, crunchy, perfect results every single time. That's what the original Phillips Air Fryer does for you. It gives you great flavor with a fraction of the fat. Uh, Stephanie Roberts is here. Hey. Cannot have this air fryer without you. Oh, of course uh, not. This is a, uh, you know, about 95 or 96,000 sold uh, since this was launched uh, back in 2013. And I will tell you, it's the original. This is the one that started it all. Exactly. When it first came out, it was about two, 250 bucks. Brand new technology. Everybody loved it. But what we did is we said, let's make it a best value of the day and let's drop it down. We were going to go 149, 139. We got them to get down under $100 for the first time ever. In fact, you know who's buying it? Tons of employees are buying it now it. because they're like, oh my God, you know, because we can't, we can't buy everything. We wish we could. But now we are getting a great price too. So all of our employees have been buying it and you can get it too for $99.95. It's all about the rapid air technology which circulates air around the food, elevates the food from underneath, the air gets all around. It's air frying. You know, all most food out there has a little bit of residual oil. Some has more than others. So it's already got the ability to be crispy. Why add more oil? Why take wings and put them in fat? That doesn't make any sense. They're covered in fat. Just use a little bit. As much as, as little as a teaspoon is all you need That's to use. That's all you need. And you know we're not limited on what we can make, right? We are not. All right, so we started out by showing you those crispy, crunchy fries and chicken strips because there's the deal. That is what oh, people like to crunchy. eat. But when you do it in the air fryer, you are getting your chicken strips with 75% less fat. The French fries, just as crispy and crunchy as always without the fat. So you're not okay. giving up the crisp and crunch. You're giving up the oil. And I don't want the oil anyway. I just want the crisp and crunch of the food. So the fact that I can do that with 75% okay. okay. less. Look, look how it. juicy that you is see inside. How juicy. Look at this. Mm. And you see the crust on the outside? And yet what's missing is that greasy, nasty mess. Nobody, we don't need that. You, you don't, don't want if that. If you use this, how, many, how much fat and calories you'll save by the end of the year? Yep. It's Crazy. absolutely amazing. Same yes. with the chicken wings. There's nothing wrong with chicken wings. It's a lean protein, mm. but it's a problem when we submerge it in a vat of fat. Look oh, at the no. golden brown color of that wing. There is not one drop of added oil mm. in this chicken wing. I don't have to fry my wings, put some salt and pepper on them, put them in the air fryer, mm. and let the rapid air technology do the work. It is all what's happening inside this air fryer that sets Phillips apart. Guy said it best, this was the original air yeah. fryer. This is what brought air frying technology to the United States. Since then, we've sold 94,000 of them here at HSN, and we are now able to bring that technology to you. I want to explain what's happening inside the air fryer, because that is so important for you to understand what air frying is all about. It's the circulation of hot air in the Philips air fryer. But what makes Philips different is what's called the starfish shape of the pan. Hey, there's other air fryers out there. By the way, they all copied Philips. Yeah. 
That's yes. okay. We'll take the flattery. Yep. Imitation is flattery. But what they can't copy is the starfish shape of the pan. This is patented for Philips. Only the Philips air fryer, which was the first, has the starfish. Why do you care? Because with starfish technology, the air goes up and around all parts of your food. Right. Food is three-dimensional. If you don't have the starfish shape of the pan, the air just spins like this. So the tops don't get crunchy, the bottoms don't get crunchy, the sides don't get crunchy. Look at this chicken wing. It is crispy and crunchy, whoops, I have to hold on to it, on absolutely every edge. That is the starfish difference. If I don't have the Phillips, I don't get the even crisping. You mentioned that it's not just for fried food. No. Heck no, it's not. We use this for everything from fresh fruit to fruits to veggies. Fajitas, one of my go-to favorites. My kids beg for this dinner with this skirt steak. Veggies on the bottom. I've used onions, peppers. Sometimes I throw in some mushrooms. A yeah. little bit of spicing. Put my skirt steak on top. I added no oil. Now, if I make these on the stove, what, four to six tablespoons of oil, yeah, yeah. gotta stand there and saute, yeah. splatters all over. And you, wanna, and you know, you're gonna light up the grill for two people? No, right? too four, much you know, work, you are you gonna broil, that? you don't wanna heat up no. the oven for just Charcoal. the skirt steak. No. Do it right here. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the air fryer time and temperature control. I can change it any way I need it each and every time I cook. For raw meats, I'm gonna put 10 minutes for my skirt steak. I'm gonna leave my temperature on high. Now, anytime I cook anything, I've got a great little reminder right there on the side of the air fryer that gives me some basic times and temps for some of my favorite foods. You also get a card inside of your Philips air fryer that reminds you of this as well. But now, I can walk away because this has automatic heat shut off Dinner. so that if I'm not standing right here when the fajitas are done yeah. they don't overcook the meat doesn't get dry the cheeses <clears> don't <throat> burn with what I'm cooking and suddenly I've got time back yeah so I'm saving fat and calories I'm saving not having to stand here and babysit yep and everything cooks quicker because we've got that circulating hot air. We're gonna do this live for you. We're gonna, we're gonna eat these live. They're gonna be amazing. It'll only take a matter of minutes. Really quickly, Stephanie, let me go through colors fast. Yes, so please do. Gray ex exclusive, only find that here at HSN. Same with the red. I have it in white and I have it in black. They all do the same, doesn't matter what color. They all have the uh, the, uh, the the starfish technology which spreads the air around. You know, I was just, I was, I was thinking to myself and I was talking to my buddy Jared, our producer, my mother, who's in her 80s, mm -hmm doesn't feel comfortable using the big giant oven anymore. Okay. This would be perfect for her. This is beyond her. perfect. Her and John, so they could heat up, because they like like little chicken pot pies. Perfect. And little meals for one or two. No need oh to gosh. heat up the oven, whether it's safety reasons, whether it's heating up your kitchen, yeah. whether you just want better results. All right, let's see oh. who can do a better job pulling cheese. Oh, you got me right off the yeah, bat I'm doing, there. I'm doing a little bit better Look than you. Look at that. So what we're doing is showing you how well the circulating yeah. hot air melts cheese. And this to me shows how even the circulation is. If you put a cheese stick in the oven to bake it, it flattens down on one side. It sticks to the pan. The cheese oozes out the back end. When you have even heating, look what happens. It gets ooey Goo. and gooey each and every time. I gotta tell you, the way the air fryer handles cheese is worth the purchase alone. And we've had many hosts that claim the reason they broke down to get one is the grilled cheese sandwich. Greatest thing I ever had in my life. Exactly. So so here's why we like grilled cheese sandwiches, that right? so good. You get the crispy, crunchy bread, but how do you make it on the stovetop? You put a whole ton of butter on each side of the bread. Here in the air fryer, I'm not gonna use any butter. I'm gonna lightly brush both sides of the of bread. Oil. Just a little bit. Yeah. You could use flavored, you could use a mister, you yeah. can do whatever you, you want. Spray it, whatever. And anytime I add oil to anything in the air fryer, the only reason I'm adding it is for just a little extra crisp. Yeah. This will turn crispy with no oil on it, but I want that golden brown color. I want that extra crunch. So I'm using less than a teaspoon. So I take my sandwich mm -hmm. and I put it in my air fryer. And now, by, by the way, invest in one of those little brushes because you were amazed, and you'll be amazed how much fat you save when you use a brush. Exactly. Instead of putting it on with a knife. To yes, <laughs> a very right? good point there. Yeah. So this is what the air fryer consists of. Two pieces, no tiny little parts, nothing to soak and scrub and have to deal with. My mesh basket allows the heat to circulate around the food. And guess what? 
There's the starfish. Mm. This is the starfish technology that we are talking about that is exclusive to Philips. Check the competitor air fryers out there. They don't look like this on no. the bottom. This is why Philips is different. So I put the pan, the mesh basket inside the pan. I put the pan in the air fryer and then I let the circulating hot air do the work. You yeah, can it see is. it right there. Starfish technology, rapid air technology. This is all exclusive to Philips. Yes, there's other air fryers out there. By the way, Philips came first. We literally launched an entire revolution in how you eat I food know. right here well, on HSN. It was such a good idea. It's you can't amazing. blame a lot of the other chefs or whoever, you know, they're like, oh my God, it's, it is brilliant technology because what it does is it takes for about the price of a, of a decent toaster mm -hmm. it takes your oven it shrinks it down it does a better job because a lot yep. of ovens don't have convection type cooking mixed with radiant and all the other things but it does it in a way that's healthier so you know when you eat when you buy bags of frozen food most of it has either been fried or baked but previously it's all pre-cooked all you need to do is add the crisp that's what this does Phillips adds the crisp no matter what you put in there plus you can cook uh, from scratch meals you can put pieces of fish in there you don't even have to turn them you could do eggs in here you do any kind of a bread product you can bake in here I mean it goes on and on and on speaking of which speaking of fish and look at it there is no better way to cook fish absolutely right? the salmon okay so here's why I love fish in the air fryer because it seals in the moisture that circulating hot air does a perfect job cooking it and then you roast some vegetables along with it oh my gosh if you've never had roasted Brussels sprouts this is the thing to try you know if you get these in the restaurant do you know how they get them crispy and crunchy in a restaurant Roast they fry them. Yeah. They fry them in yeah. oil. You know, they roast them in a big old pan oh, of oil. Oh, yeah, when they do, like, if you see them and they, and they look greasy, yep. that's because they came out of grease. Exactly. This is actually the best way to cook. We have done ours with absolutely no added grease. At most, maybe I put a spritz of olive oil on mine when I do it. But one thing I am definitely not doing is having to soak them in oil. I want to flip that. into look this it. fish a little bit. Look at the moisture in oh, there. Look at how amazing that looks, that Perfect. sheen. That is exactly what you you want with your fish and now I can do fish in the air fryer I don't have to worry about baking it in the oven and drying it out I don't have to worry about submerging my vegetables in oil I mean come on we're eating vegetables let's keep I it know, healthy know, I'm I proud know. of myself for eating the vegetables but no matter what you're eating as soon as you add this this keeps it from being healthy so what Phillips is doing is that we are literally taking that away nothing we cook needs that ever again everything we have shown you and everything we cook every single day one tablespoon or less of yeah. oil this is it this is all you need with the Phillips air fryer because it's just enough to give a teensy tiny extra crunch if you want it and quite honestly there's no reason why you can't cook it with zero oil our chicken yeah. wings zero Don't oil the french fries and chicken strips zero oil maybe this for some of the other foods to get that extra crunch but that's it that's all it is and you're going to save a boatload of calories by the end of the year again uh, if you want gray, you can only find gray and red here. We have it available in white. We have it available in black. They all work the same. They are easy to operate. It's a turn of a crank. Time here, it, all the timing is simple. You get all the, uh, the, the the information, recipes, ideas, times, all that stuff. It's easy. I love, too, Stephanie, that it allows us to kind of unleash a little bit of creativity. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Things you'd never tried before. Like I, I know I've seen you do this before. It's brilliant. Now, normally, what would you do? You're going to heat up the whole oven to cook that? To bake an egg. You're going to use a cheesy little toaster oven that doesn't really work and doesn't have convection, or are you going to use this? Yeah, the toaster oven gives you the uneven heating. What I like about yeah. using this for things other than frying, per se, is that even circulation. So, gosh, avocados couldn't be better, and John Floro has that great tool he showed yeah. us about to use. But I put an egg in mine for breakfast maybe sprinkle on a little cheese pre or post some salt and pepper and Pop in 10 in. minutes and oh by the way I can go dry my hair or walk the dog or whatever for those 10 minutes yeah. this is going to sit here on my counter and, and cook and by the way on the other side there's a little cheat sheet right there that exactly. shows you right times. and that comes to you with your air fryer on a card as well ready to go and yep. you know what else comes to you with this is the ability to join an online community with thousands oh, of recipes people are passionate about air fryer 
frying because it's changing the way you eat. It has changed the way I cook dinner for my family because there's nothing I can't make in the air fryer. So the Philips app will give you access to just hundreds of recipes and social media is full of them as well. You are not going to be without oh things Lord. to cook. This is one of the most beautiful meals you'll ever serve out of here. And this is just a stuff with a stuffed chicken breast. Yes. And okay, here's my cheat. Don't okay. tell my kids because they think right. I make this stuff by scratch. Hey, you really can buy these quickly, the by the way, I have available the uh, the uh, healthy, simple, delicious uh, Phillips air fryer cookbook. There's over 150 uh, air uh, recipes in here. It's beautifully done in color. Step-by-step -step instructions. All I would get this in a second because it gives you great, great information on how they, uh, you know, you can uh, make some of these delicious delicious meals. Do you want me to cut this for Please you? Please do. Carve right into here? that and right, show me so what's I on the inside. I want you, first of all, and I don't know how close, uh, Eddie, you can get, but this, I want you to see the crust on the outside of this. And you can see it. We're going to go really tight. Notice what's missing. You see how it's not greasy? And, and if you can hear it, can you hear that crust? It's Love unbelievable. It. So that came to me pre-stuffed and breaded. All I had to do was pop it in the air fryer. Look at those chicken breasts. See the juice and oh, the cheese Oh, that out is of so yummy. I mean, That's dinner that. in 10 minutes. We threw some fingerling potatoes under it. And those are huge breasts. I can look cut it. those in half. It's dinner for four people oh in my 10 gosh. minutes. And look at, you can see the cheese. And then look at the exterior. See how juicy that piece is? Look at the crust on the outside, all right? And that is what you can do inside. And whether you're doing a small bird, because you can go and get some little small Cornish birds. Cornish hen in there, absolutely. Throw, totally do that. Yep. You're going to get perfect. It's wonderful. It's the crunch. I mean, there's a crunch and, moist, and the moist chicken it's underneath. It's the combination of the two, all without wow. any added oil. So I love this for back to That's school. That's phenomenal. This is the time of year where we are absolutely short on time, trying to get those kids back in the routine, trying yeah. to keep people eating healthy. Tongs got them. Tongs got them down here. So as a result, what I want to do is find ways to get these mm. meals on the table without having to spend tons of time. Meatballs is another great way to do it. Look at the gorgeous crust on top of these meatballs. Now, I know Crazy. the true Italian way to do this is to fry up the meatballs on the stovetop. But the only reason you're frying them is to get the crispy, crunchy outside. To get them brown. Yeah, yeah, you don't have to fry in oil to get them brown. You can air fry. I am saving tons and tons of fat and calories. And oh, by the way, we can talk about some of the additional things you can pick up with the yeah, air get fryer. Up the little One of tray. them is this rack. Yeah. It doubles my capacity. Look at the difference there. That wow. is absolutely amazing. I'm going to pull out more than 20 meatballs when I'm using that rack. So Look I like this. picking up some of those extras as well. But I'm still pulling meatballs because this holds so Look much food. Wow. Two pounds of meat officially. And I love the fact that dinner is done. Again, so I put my meatballs in 10 minutes maybe. I go walk the dog. I go read the mail. I put the pasta water on to boil. Look By the that. time the pasta is cooked, I have dinner on the and, table. And you have not had to soak these in any kind of an oil. Remember, we, you know, we're talking about whether you do pork and beef for your for your meal, whatever it is for your meatballs. Right. They have inherent fat in them. They because you probably made them with an egg. You probably put some cheese in there. They don't need to be cooked in oil. They can be roasted, basically air fried, inside our unit. And you get all that that capacity. And look what you don't get. So here's what you're saying with the inherent fat. If I cook this on the stovetop, number one, I'm cooking in oil. Number yeah. two, this fat reabsorbs into my meat. So not only am I not using the oil, I am taking off fat. This is not reabsorbing into my food. So I'm literally saving twice. I'm saving yeah. by not eating this, and I'm saving by not using the fat and oil. And this convinced me I don't ever need to well, fry meat in a pan again. And guess what? That's one tray of meatballs. Imagine using this machine two, three hundred times a year, how much fat you will save. You know, yep. anybody that is in the dieting industry, anybody that's in the fitness industry will tell you, when you want to get healthy, what, what they'll say, what's the best way for me to... To, 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 to feel good and to get healthy. And they won't, they won't name it a piece of exercise equipment. They won't tell you to run or jog. They'll say groceries. Yes. They will look at you and they will say, buy good food and cook it properly. Right. That's what you do. So eat as much as you can, get a percentage of your food that's raw, a, per, a large percentage that when it's cooked, it's done in a way that's healthy, not deep fried, not soaked in oil. You know, start with fresh ingredients. Like those meatballs, you get to go out and get your organic meat, and your cheese, all that. You've got a delicious meatball. Why sit and, and, and then deep fry it when you don't have to? Same with baking. 
I yes. mean, look, look at how puffy Bake it that fresh. pastry is. Okay, these are one of my weaknesses, I will admit. So we have taken puff pastry. You can buy these frozen. You can make them fresh. But what we do when we bake them is we get this crispy. Oh, look at this. Lord. That it's is that, as crispy. That's, that's why I like the grilled cheese so much. I know, because of as the crispy outside. and crunchy as can be. But look at the inside. It is light. It is fluffy. Oh, it dear is Lord. absolutely oozing with goodness. That peaches, Eric? If I did this in the oven, I would have to heat up my entire oven to 400 degrees and run it for 20 minutes for literally the real estate wow. of eight inches. Or I can do it on my counter, saving energy, yeah. saving time, getting breakfast in my kids as yeah. they head out the door, and you are good you to go. You know what's wonderful is that they have the, the pre-made sandwiches and croissant sandwiches and absolutely. English muffins sandwiches for the kids, pancakes, yep. Do all here. stuff that all you need to do is you get a little crust on it. Perfect example, a, a, a nice big hunk or slice of pie, a yep. pizza. Pizza. Right? So whether you buy it frozen like this one, which by the way, they sell in every grocery store they and do. it fits in sections. perfectly yeah. right into the air fryer. Five minutes, a snack is done. You're out of the drive through line. You're not yeah. spending money you don't want to. You're not adding fats from things in fast food. Yeah. But it also works. And if you have the rack, you can put two pieces in there, by the way, just exactly. so you know. Exactly. Yeah. But it also works just as well to re-crisp pizza. If you've ordered pizza the night before, or if you've gone out and had french fries and chicken strips as a splurge at a restaurant the next day, this will re-crisp your leftovers like yeah. nothing else. Because remember, you don't need the oil to do the crisping. All you need is the circulating you, air and everything comes to you life. You know what I do in here, which is amazing, and What's it's that? the only way to reheat it? If you do stuff like, like I love, and I'm a, I'm a freakish fan of like for pork fried rice from the, from like okay. the Asian place. Sure. You can't microwave that. It doesn't come out the same the next day. It's weird. If you air fry to do it in here. Yeah. For just a few minutes, it comes back to life. Oh. You know the breath of the dragon that it has that smoky right. flavor. That right. It tastes like you just had it fresh again. So it's great for reheating leftovers. To your point, it's fantastic. Melting cheese. You look. We did, you can do the whole burger in there. Exactly. You know what? I hate to say it, but summer's winding down. We're going to be out of grilling season. What? You don't need to broil your food. Don't fry your burgers. Look Go ahead and do them right here in the Phillips air fryer. Look at the results in this. Look oh at the gosh. juicy meat. Look yeah, at the, I got job. cheese everywhere. But I like the fact that I can do this right on my countertop. Because here's the thing, especially around dinner time, I got a lot going on. I got kids going every which way. The oh, dog yeah. needs to eat. I don't have to turn these. I don't have to watch these. I put them in Look. the air fryer. I set it for 10 minutes and yeah. I go about my business. Are you kidding me? Look at how juicy they are. And you know, that's another thing. People are like, well, I, I have to do that on the grill. You don't no, have you to. Don't. In fact, let me tell you something, and I, and I don't know what Eric feels about this as well, but like my son and myself and my son, Danny likes the burgers better when they're, when they're done, like when they're like cooked inside. He doesn't like them out on the grill. He, it sears and you can taste the meat better. Exactly, so this is and a it's great, even. Yeah. And it's even. By the way, what? we can bake in our Phillips air fryer. This is another additional item. You can pick up the baking pan. You know what I'd like to do is run my finger right along that nonstick edge and I'd get all that sugar in there. there. I, would, I wouldn't use the finger. <laughs> I'd put my face inside. So we have literally baked the perfect cake. Again, even heating. It's like a mini convection oven. Look how wow. golden brown and perfect that is. Yeah. The caramelized sugar on the inside of the pan. It oh is wonderful. By the way, this is great. Must have. You got to get the little baking pan to go yes. along with it because you can also do things. You know what I? You can do things like beans with bacon. You know, you can heat soups. You can when you have that pan, you could. It pretty much opens the world of everything <coughs> to you. All right. So when we started, we put some fries in, right? We did. So we know French fries, obviously the go-to <coughs> that me. we love to air fry. But you know, you go to the restaurants and you get the fancy fries. Maybe they're garlic That's parmesan, or maybe they're truffled, or whatever. You know, oh you can gosh. do that right at home as well. So we've got a spray-on herb here that is the mm. essential oil of my herb. So I'm mm. going to give a little kick to my French fries. All right. I'm going to add a little Parmesan on top. Mm. And on the same night, you can have strips and fries for the kids. And then you can have an adult version of those fries as well. Don't pay 10 bucks for that appetizer. Do it right at home. It could not be easier. But Look I've got that. that golden brown. I've got the crispy crunch. Kids are going to love you. I mean, honestly, and you can do it all the time. You know what I love? And if you want to be even more healthy, they're making these the tots out of vegetables now. I don't know if you've had oh, the cauliflower. Oh, absolutely. Zucchini um, they tots. Are, they are perfect inside here. Okay. Beginning of the show, we started off our fajitas. Let's see how 
Well, those came out. Okay, so oh, here's what perfect. we did. If you missed the load, we took skirt steak and placed it on top of our fajita vegetables. No, as in zero added oil. Look at the color of those veggies. Oh my God. And here's how it works. The skirt <laughs> steak has fats and juices naturally, right? So they drip down onto they the vegetables. Everything. They did. They oh made it gosh, absolutely look. amazing. So you've got the flavors that you want in the what fajitas. The heck? But here's my go to. I want to know how the steak turns out. I love skirt steak cooked in the air fryer. When I slice into this, look at the juicy goodness on the inside. That is an absolutely perfect medium, and it is perfect every single time. Look at the color. Look at yeah, the sear beautiful. on the outside, on yeah. the top and on the bottom and on the edges. Again, because of the starfish technology, the circulating hot air, this is picture perfect each and every Yum. time. This makes me a better home cook. Yeah. Because well, I am uh, able to get it right yeah. every time. And again, here's how it works. All you do is you add your food in, you let it go, and this is the this is the brilliance of the design. The built-in fan actually engages the air, the superheated air from the infrared section of this, and it runs it down into those channels that look like a... Starfish. Fish. Exactly right. <laughs> and that channel's them back up so it goes in and around and through your food that's what creates the 360 degree frying technology that you are accustomed to when you deep fat fry when you deep fat fry the food is surrounded completely by oil we take the oil out we put air in that's all we do all right if you have been watching, there is the greatest thing on the planet that this makes is probably the most simple. <laughs> it's true. And that is a grilled sandwich. And whether you like to do corned beef or you like to do ham and cheese or turkey clubs or whatever, but when you just go the old fashioned pure grilled cheese, yeah, oh my lord. Did you hear the crunch? It's ridiculous. Okay, look at the golden brown. Oh, Absolutely perfect help. each and every time. This is maybe a teaspoon of oil brushed on, right. and that is it. But the big That's test ridiculous. is, did it melt my cheese? Yeah, I think it oh, did. Oh, yes, it did. So yeah, I am crispy, I am crunchy, and I am enjoying the best ooey gooey grilled cheese ever. Look at, look at, look and it's picture perfect every time. It's just, it's ridiculous. It's so ridiculous. Oh my lord! And, I love and it's it. the way the crust comes out. It's you know what it, it smells like. If you walked into a bakery, smell you know that really. Oh yeah. It's kind of a the because comfort. of the olive oil and because of the toast smell. I love the smell of toast. It's one of those things that you wake up to it, it wakes you up like bacon. It makes you feel but happy. But it is so good. The flavor is amazing, and the cheese melts perfectly all the way through. What are those? These are my avocado eggs. Again, we can do breakfast. We can do anything we want in the air fryer. Whether you're making scotch eggs, whether you're using the baking pan and making a frittata, you can get in here and make an egg to however you want. We have baked that avocado so that it will fall apart in your mouth. This gets my kids a healthy protein-packed meal in 10 minutes. I didn't have to stand here and watch the grilled cheese. The air circulates on its own. The heat shuts off when my timer hits yeah. zero. And I walk away. I do not have time in the morning to stand at the stove and up. make omelets and frittatas. I no. wish I did. But I can pop eggs into my air fryer. It does the cooking. I grab, and honestly, I put these in a little takeaway container. They can eat it in the car yeah. on their way to school. Well, and they've got a healthy breakfast. And you can teach them to use this very easily, okay? I, 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 I would not let Danny get, get near any of my ovens. But this in a second, I would be, hey, go, go ahead. I mean, well, turning a button is nothing, you, you can't mess no, it up. It's warm to the touch, not hot. You will not get burned. We've been cooking on this for 20 minutes. I can lean on it and talk to you. So it's great to teach your family about how to get things going in the kitchen, about how to make healthy eating choices. And honestly, if they participate in making the food, they're that much more likely to eat it. So I like to alleviate mom guilt by having quick, simple recipes that I can elevate. So yeah. let's Probably, let's talk about fish sticks, right? I may fight a little guilty if I serve fish sticks for dinner, but no, I'm air frying them, so we're not adding any better. oil and fat. That's right. better. But what about if I take my fish sticks and I nest them in some corn tortillas <gasps> over some coleslaw, maybe throw in a little fresh a squeeze great of lime, and suddenly, now we're not having fish sticks. We are having fish tacos for dinner. What are you going to squirt on there? Add a little bit of crema on top top and we are good to go <laughs> and you know what's funny is that the hard part about making fish tacos is having to pick out the fish and deal with all that and how am I gonna cook it and blah 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 
This you go is to the how. store, you trust the Gordon fisherman, you allow him to give you some delicious fish, you put it in the thing, you turn it on for, for what, 10 minutes, it comes out, 10 minutes. and you pop it inside a taco shell, and you are now a genius. Absolutely. Absolute genius. Crispy, and, crunchy. Oh my, God. And, and you know what, none of the guilt of deep fried? No, I don't feel guilty at all. I've got veggies in my taco, I've got crispy, crunchy fish without oil, I've got a nice protein source, and everybody's eating. And that's, that's what the goal of dinner yeah. with families is, is to make everyone eat. You love it now. You and I know because I know this lovely lady. Wait till holidays get here, and oh, you are making yep. snacks for people, and you are running around busy because you're holiday shopping, or it's you're trying to figure out what to do for that for that Halloween party. What kind of hors d'oeuvres? What kind of snacks can I make? Right. Anything you can put in a traditional oven. Depending on obviously size is the only thing you have to worry about because you're not doing a 30 pound turkey in here. But anything you can pretty much do in an oven, you can do in this little mini compact oven. And I'm talking about lots of food. So if you want to do popcorn, buffalo, whatever the heck, shrimp. Buffalo you got shrimp. Here. Well, and you were talking about parties. My favorite season is coming up, and that would be football season. Yeah, so girl. when we're sitting down to hang out for games, this popcorn is a shrimp. two pound bag of popcorn shrimp. I mean, we've got capacity. So I took my two Ooh. pound box of shrimp, I dumped it in 10 minutes. I get my crispy crunchy on the outside. Now I'm gonna toss it in my favorite wing sauce. So I've got this amazing buffalo smell going right now. Sprinkle a little blue cheese on top, serve it with a little celery, a little yeah. carrots, and you are having a great party. You don't have to go out. You don't have to spend a ton of money. And here's the thing, had I done this at a restaurant, right. they would have fried the <clears throat> shrimp yeah. and I would be consuming oh so many more calories. Now, and, and breading is just like a sponge. It soaks up oil so bad. You don't want to do that. You know, when they flash fry these at the, at the uh, uh, you know, when they create, when they make them, that's enough. That'll all kind of leach out as you're cooking. You'll see that there'll be frying oil left at the bottom. That's what you don't want to take inside. Absolutely. Uh, so it's going to help with that as well. Do not forget about the cookbook, about the uh, the recipe book, excuse me. All these, one, there's, there's 150 air fryer recipes inside the Phillips air fryer uh, book. This is only $24.95. I'm trying to open it up so you can see some of the pictures in there but I mean anything you could possibly want to make you know you saw some of our look at that yeah that looks good don't know what it is but I'll take it uh, that's an egg roll so you can and by the way buy your egg rolls at the store and bring them home and freaking put them in here. They're, oh, they, they will crispy, crisp up crunchy, like nothing. Absolutely wonderful. Yeah. I want to show you again the starfish on the bottom of the pan. We fully acknowledge that there are other air fryers out there. There is not another air fryer out there with a starfish on the bottom of the pan. This is what separates Phillips. This is the original air fryer that came to the United States. This is where the whole thing started and obviously lots of other chefs have said okay that's an amazing idea I better make right. one of those too well but they're not making it with starfish they can't it's patented this is only Phillips technology so the reason it matters is the way the heat circulates around the starfish it goes up and around all edges of the food your food is three-dimensional you don't want a flat bottomed no. air fryer because then you're <clears throat> not going to get crispy and crunchy all over your food that's why you want the Phillips air fryer it's the original and it never at a better price at $99.95, lowest price we've ever done, and you'll ever find it anywhere. And it's on FlexPay for only $19.99. Listen, if you're an empty nester, if you are a single person, if you have kids, grandkids that come over and they want some snacks, moms, dads, grandparents, you can get stuff made so quick. By the time your oven's even preheating, and by the way, it's still preheating with this thing. It takes 30 seconds. You turn it on, the, the, the infrared or the, uh, the radiant uh, technology kicks in. It's Absolutely. already hot. And then it moves that air around. So listen, we have less than a minute remaining. We're never gonna have it at a lower price. Everybody here at the network is buying one of these. You know, everybody saw the price and we're like, oh my gosh, we gotta get these. I'm gonna get one today. I'm gonna buy one for my mom. My mom's in her 80s and she loves to still cook, but she doesn't like to work on the stove. She doesn't like to work on the stove top. Like, right. you know, like she's, you know, she's nervous cooking bacon, sausage. You could do all that stuff inside the air fryer. Well, and look at that. I mean, we've been what, on for about 25 minutes yeah. here. The amount of food that we have cranked out because everything cooks more quickly with the circulating hot air, whether it's pizza, to potato skins, oh to fresh meatballs cooked from raw, to the favorite mm. chicken strips, to burgers. You can do absolutely anything right mm. on your countertop with one tablespoon or less of oil. It's changed the way it all has. of us eat. Yeah, and it matters over time collectively. If you save a little bit here, a little bit there, at the end of the year, that's pounds of fat that you cannot be putting inside your body. So it really is, it's a healthy alternative. 
but you don't sacrifice anything. Nope. I mean, the flavor is there. It's absolutely, if you've always wanted to try one, get the original, get the, uh, the Phillips uh, Starfish. It's the one that started this whole trend and they've lowered the price lower than it's ever been before. $19.99 on FlexPay. Hey, by the way, all of our uh, products, you know, come with warranties, but there's a lot of people out there that would like a little extra added protection. We call it, oh, my mouth is watering, I barely talk here. <laughs> He's ready to eat. I'm so ready to jump into that grilled cheese. So we call it Protection Plus. It's a great way to protect your product, hassle-free, 24-7, no deductibles, and it extends the warranty on lots of things that you uh, that you get. And that's, for a lot of people, makes them feel more comfortable. Continue to dial in with our best value of the day. Uh, and again, want to talk about the book. Where is it? Is it right here? Mm, you caught me eating. All right, so that's fine. <laughs> so, so this is available, and if you want to get it, there are so many great recipes. Even look at corn on the cob, stuffed chicken uh, breasts. You can do uh, tarts, you can do quiche, chicken wings. You can do all that stuff and it's right inside here. It's only $24.95. When are you on again, my dear? I will be back at 11. Okay, so continue to shop. And remember, we're doing, thank you so much, Stephanie. We're doing Good up to 25% on dot com for your top kitchen brands it's a great time to be shopping so take advantage of that hey uh, our today's special too also available oh i love this thing if you're looking for security you know people coming in trying to steal your fried food because they smell your air fryer <laughs> well guess what now you can see them on the outside before they get in with the ring doorbell this is the ring two security video doorbell with two-way talk and the ring assist so you can see the people outside you can speak to them before they get in the house and anybody there that knows anything about security knows the key is to keep them outside right it's, it's it doesn't do you much good if they're already in when your alarm goes off this is going to give you uh, information on the outside in different zones as to who's out there friend or foe and then you can take the uh, the appropriate action after that whether you need to call the authorities or whatever you got to do but uh, take advantage of that it's a great price at only $159.95 uh, I'm heading out for a bit I will see you later on in the week and the lovely Alice and the lovely Tony Little will be joining you next well hi everyone I'm Alice Curran we are going to make you look good and we're